Africa has one of the fastest growing smartphone consumer bases on the planet. Every day, Africans are using their phones to connect, communicate and make payments. UTAP, a global provider of contactless mobile payments and financial service software, is launching new QR code solutions and smartphone apps for Africa. This is all to try and improve and simplify the way Africans make payments. And we're on the line now with Sean Morgan, who is the general manager of sales in Africa for UTAP. And he's with us from Nairobi in Kenya. Good morning, Sean. Morning, Joey. How are you doing today? Very well, thank you. How are you? Uh, you know what? No complaints. Well, listen, we just want to ask you, you know, Africa has shown some, a massive boom in the smartphone usage over these last couple of years. But what has led to this, do you think? Well, we see it really being driven by three main factors. Uh, the first one being... Today's uh, pricing on smartphones is going down further and further. So the barriers to entry to owning a smartphone are, are being reduced by price. At the same time, you see a lot of the mobile network operators which are dropping the price of data. Uh, if I can give you an example, just two weeks ago, uh, MTN in Cameroon uh, made available a data package, five gigabytes for less than $1. Sure. Uh, and then the third factor is the rising use of applications. So we know in Africa, most people today are either communicating through WhatsApp or Facebook Messenger. So the, the smartphone becomes the, the vehicle for many parts of people's daily life. So it's just becoming easier for people to just have more access to it. Now, Sean, how, can you explain to me the new QR solution technology that you guys are implementing? What kind of payments will... How will this make payments easier? Yes, yeah, so it's a very simple technology, QR codes, and it's really designed to appeal to a mass market solution that allows any merchant anywhere to accept payments using mobile money or connected to a mobile wallet. Uh, what's really important about the use of mobile money today is a lot of the solutions are, are USSD based and they contain a lot of friction. So with the QR code, all the uh, consumer needs to simply do is take out their, their smartphone, running a consumer application that can scan a QR code and take a photo of a, a QR code sitting at a merchant point, which makes it fast and very easy to use. Uh, and it's available to any type of merchant, any type of consumer. And what's important about that, it's not just people that have bank accounts. Uh, what they're really trying to do is drive financial inclusion for all people in Africa and give access to these types of services for the unbanked population as well. Okay. And you know what, I need to ask you, you know, what are some of the challenges you, 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 you think you'll face when rolling out this technology? Uh, I mean, this technology can be rolled out very, very quickly and fast. Uh, a lot of the payments we see today that are happening, say, in a supermarket that are using a traditional point-of-sale device require a lot of uh, labour intensity to make that happen. You need a device, you need someone to support it. The QR code technology is so simple. All it requires is somebody to have a smartphone. A merchant can download an application from, say, the Play Store or the Apple Store, uh, the same can be done for a consumer. And all they need to do is have that code registered uh, with a mobile wallet and they'll be able to accept payments. So it's a very, very simple technology which is available to all people. Awesome. Well, Sean, thank you so much for talking to us and informing us a little bit more about UTAP. Great. Thanks very much, Zoe. Have a great day. Thank you. You too. Well, that was Sean Morgan from UTAP. And Africa truly is going through a mobile revolution. And we can't wait to see where this kind of technology will take the continent in the future. Well, they blew us away before.